Uh, we are following breaking news overseas at this hour now. The U.S. just started launching manned and unmanned retaliatory strikes in Syria and Iraq. So far, they have reportedly been targeting command and control headquarters, ammunition storage, and other facilities. This is all in retaliation for a drone strike on an American base in Jordan on Sunday that killed three, uh, three U.S. service members and injured more than 40 others. It happened at the Tower 22 base near Jordan's border with Iraq and Syria. The U.S. says that Iran is responsible for funding and arming the militants who carried out that attack on U.S. troops. Iran has denied any involvement, but again, retaliatory strikes by the U.S. have begun in Syria and Iraq this hour. This comes on the same day that President Biden and First Lady Jill Biden joined the families of those service members who were killed over the weekend. They arrived at Dover Air Base in uh, Delaware today for the dignified transfer. We will uh, keep you updated on any new developments on the airstrikes on air and online at WFAA.com.